Oh, that's all we get? Is there a date? No date? I want that. Take my money. Take my money now. Arceus! Hello there. Hello there. What's up guys, KP here, and today I'm actually reacting to something that I saw earlier today. Not like actually like legit saw, but you know what I'm saying, like I heard of it. It came across my... Realm of knowledge. Pokemon had something that's called a Pokemon Direct. I'm new to this type of thing, so I never knew they had this type of thing going on, but basically, Evidently, they made some pretty big announcements. One, one in particular that I'm extremely, I hope that it's how I've seen on social media. And I was hoping it's like what I've heard. I haven't watched any of this myself. But without further ado, we finna go watch this together and see what it's all about. Unless you've already seen it. But hey, we can watch it together again. You know what I'm saying? We'll go ahead and jump into it. All right. I'd already started a little 10 seconds. I'm probably just going to go for the gameplay here, guys. So, this is going to be skipped around. 25 years of non-stop adventure. Show me something. Get me hype. I want to be hype. What's up? I played all those games. Y'all. Played it. I had the cards, too. Y'all. I wonder if this is copyrighted. Didn't have it, but I played it. Yo, gold and silver. Bro, this is me right here. These are the ones I played the most, man. Emerald. Where's Emerald? Leaf green. Yo! Bro, I love that game so much, bro. 2006. Yes. I remember legit being in school playing this, bro. Platinum is my favorite game of all time. There it is right there. Pl I love Platinum. Platinum is my favorite Pokemon game of all time, bro. I remember playing that too. Yo. I played that one too. I played Y. I played Y. Bro, this little this little part right here is fire. I didn't play those. I want to play them. It's music though. Hey. Watch this be copyrighted. Y'all probably ain't gonna see this. Hey. I played that for sure. I got sword. Yo. It was a little easy, but it was still fun. Bruh. Y'all have no idea, like, I've literally been through most of that stuff, bro. It's like being a kid, bro. This brings back so many memories, bro. It's crazy. Hello, everyone. I'm Ishihara. And, and this is the part where I'm going to skip to the games. February 27th. Moments later. The latest update on the new Pokemon Snap game. Okay, we've Pokemon put together Snap. We've a video that will show you some of the game. Show Please me some. Below. Okay, I'm interested. This isn't the one that I'm hyped about, but I would love to get. I, I'll play it. I don't care. What's up? Welcome to the world of new Pokemon Snap. Okay. This is the Lentil region. You'll the Lentil? ride the Neo One through the jungle, across the desert. It looks nice. And even under the sea to research Pokemon in their natural habitats. Okay. 
And of course, you won't be alone. Look at them graphics, Professor though. Professor who's doing research in the lentil region, and research team members Rita and Phil are there to support you. So you're in good hands. Okay, okay. Now then, let's get that research started. By watching wild Pokemon, you can discover behaviors and expressions that are Bro. rarely seen. Stuff Look, like this. A surfing Alolan Raichu. And there's Vaporeon. Vaporeon. Let's try throwing it a fluff fruit. That's it. Now's our chance. For the people that are like around my age, I'm 20, I'm 24. Oh, it's Tyranitar. Stuff like this, seeing this what is a crazy. Wild way to eat. And I'm pretty sure people that are a little bit older Here's than me. A park at night. Let's try playing a melody. Or even more mind blown. Oh, that sure made Hoot Hoot happy. So this is a camera game. You'll also have Illumina orbs, something the professor invented. If you use one of these, you can make any Pokemon glow. This just feels like something I would play in my pastime. Whoa, those flames changed color. Make I need to catch that one, blue flame. Take shots that really stand out. Then show the photos you took to the professor. Oh, four stars. We captured a rare moment there. Catch a variety of different behaviors on camera to fill up your Pokemon photo decks. And there's so more. it's basically you'll be able to edit camera, the photos you've taken. An immersive Pokemon camera game Use where you observe Pokemon like in their natural state. To make your favorite Very intriguing. Even more special. I would play it in my pastime. And I'm sure you'll want Kinda. to show off your best friends, Interesting. right? We know that feeling well. But when let me see what's next. That, Hold on. It's next, I'd like to present the latest news about the Pokemon video game series. Okay, what's up? Have a look at this video. Show me something. What's up? Oh, my palms are kind of sweaty. <laughs> I'm kind of hyped for this one. Now. I ain't gonna lie. Uh, um, mm, oh, bro. The memories! Don't disappoint me, please. Oh, that music! No! Bro, that's like from Platinum. That's from Platinum. From the center region from Diamond and Pearl. I remember that music. Bro. Experience the brilliance once more. Bro. Is it really? They re they're doing the remake for real. Oh, let's go. If they're doing a remake of this, I hope they're doing a remake of Platinum. Please. Pretty, pretty please. Please. They do look kind of silly. The sprites look a little silly with the size that they're at. But it's a 3D, it's a 3D model of a 2D, of a 2D game. So, I mean, can't really complain. It looks really nice, though. The graphics look really good. Brilliant diamond. Okay. Shining pearl. You gotta... Releasing worldwide in, in late 2021? Okay, so it's this year. Okay. Alright. What else? Is there anything else? Because that's the main thing I heard about. I really do hope they come up with play. With this. This is a tale from a long, long time ago when the Sinnoh region was still only a vast wilderness. Uh -huh. A certain village bustled with the comings and goings of people. While in the mountains and seas, Pokemon roamed as they pleased. Uh huh. What else? Okay, the graphics look kind of rough, but this is better. This this is test footage. Is this an open world? Get up. Don't play with me. They got a Dark Souls roll on here? You can't Bro, 
This is literally... It's a truly, a, a, like an actual open world Pokemon game. Bro! This is literally what I like, literally like imagined as a kid of like an, a, a truly like open world Pokemon game. And it's for the Sinnoh region, correct? Bro! Oh, that's all we get? Is there a date? No date? I want that. Take my money. Take my money now. Are this? Wait, well, I'm, I'm getting too high. I'm chill out. I'm embarrassing myself. I need, I need to chill out. What about? That's what it's called? Oh, let's go. Early 2022. Okay, I'll be there. Take my money. Take my money. Additions to the Pokemon video game series. Uh huh. Taking place in the Sinnoh region. First, I'm sweating. Present the Pokemon I am sweating. Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl games. Whew. These are faithful remakes of the Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pearl version games, which were released for the Nintendo DS system in Japan 15 years ago. What am, what am I watching of this though? You showing more like gameplay of it or what? <laughs> the Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl games, remakes of the Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pearl version games, which were released for the Nintendo DS system, are coming to Nintendo Switch. They're just a little pudgy. These games will be developed <laughs> by Ilka Inc., okay. who also worked on Pokemon Home. The project <laughs> is being directed by Yuichi Ueda of Ilka, as well as Game Freak's Junichi Masuda who was the director for the original Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pearl version games. Your adventure will take place in the Sinnoh region. Rich in nature and with towering Mount Coronet at its heart, it is a land of many myths passed down through the ages. The sense of scale of the original game's towns and roots has been carefully preserved, and you'll be able to travel through familiar locations once again. You'll set out on your journey after choosing either Turtwig Chimchar or Piplup Pip the first partner Pokemon. In these games, you can enjoy a grand adventure together with all the gotcha! from Pokemon Diamond version and Pokemon Pearl version. Newcomers and previous visitors to the Sinnoh region alike can look forward to experiencing the original Pokemon Diamond and Pokemon Pearl stories, freshly recreated for Nintendo Switch. Bro, this is crazy to see. I, I literally remember pouring hours into what Diamond and Pearl think? and Platinum. Pokemon Brilliant Platinum Diamond and Pokemon specifically. Shining Pearl will launch simultaneously around the world late this year. We hope you're all excited for a nostalgic yet fresh adventure oh, in the city. let's go, bro. I, I'm ready to see. I, I want it. Next, allow me to introduce you to the Pokemon Legends Arceus game. This is what I want to see. Pokemon Legends Arceus <clears throat> represents a new approach for the Pokemon video game series. Uh-huh. Development is in full swing at Game Freak, with the aim to deliver a gaming experience that breaks new ground for the Pokemon series. Please have a look at this video. I want it. The I, events of this I, game I, unfold I, in I, the Sinnoh of old. In this time too, Mount Coronet towers over the center of the region. I know y'all remember Pokemon right live freely in the mm -hmm. wild here, but the harsh environments may be different from the Sinnoh region you remember. Okay. It's older. In this era, people have journeyed to Sinnoh from all over and founded a prosperous village in the hope of learning more about this land. Diversity. Okay, I understand. As for these three Pokemon, Rowlet, Cyndaquil, and Oshawott, it seems they were brought to Sinnoh by a certain professor These who ones. encountered them okay. while traveling around okay. various regions. All right. You'll set off on your adventure after receiving a first partner Pokemon of your own from this professor. Ashua. Well, oh no, no, Cyndaquil, no. You'll venture out to the different corners of the mm. region on your quest to create Sinnoh's very first Pokedex. 
Even in this era, Sinnoh's first Pokemon can be caught with Pokeballs. You can also engage in Pokemon battles alongside your Pokemon allies. In an open world. Like, we're not going into a Sharpen battle phase. Sharpen skills for both catching and battling Pokemon, and strive to complete your Pokedex. I'm finna catch them all for real, y'all. I swear. Is that... Now Bro. for the mythical Pokemon that graces the game's title and story, uh -huh. Arceus. Uh -huh. According to legend, Arceus shaped all there is in this world. Factual. But how is this Pokemon connected to your journey? How? The answer to this question and more awaits you in this exciting new action RPG adventure expected, for yeah. the Nintendo mm -hmm. Switch system. That's a tight mismatch. You bold for that. <laughs> Pokemon Legends Arceus will launch simultaneously around the world early next year. Early next year. Oh, I'm ready for that. I'll hope take my money now. To take set my up money all now. These adventures across the Sinnoh region. Yes. Each one distinctly different from the other. I want the wonderfully nostalgic Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Pokemon Shining Pearl, as well as the Pokemon video game mm. series New Journey, Pokemon Legends Arceus. I want that so bad. As Pokemon celebrates 25 years, we will continue to challenge ourselves and deliver new ways for everyone to enjoy Pokemon even more. Thank you very much for watching. So I think I really don't have to say this, so I'm just gonna, you know. I like that. I like that a lot. I. <laughs> I. <clears throat> In terms of impressions here, to be honest, the one that I had heard about was the actual remake, the the Diamond and the Pearl remake. That's the one that I had heard of. This one right here, I had seen this on Facebook. There are things with social media with this one. The one that I did not know about was this one, this right here. I want this. Like, I, can I pre-order? I know pre-orders are a bad thing in the gaming community at this point, but I don't care. I, I'll take it looking like this. I don't care. It looks a little rough around the edges because it's obviously a better. I will be a better tester. You want to be a better tester? Sit in the U.S. I'll take it. I, I, I promise. I, I want this. Like, the, like, the literal. I know it's look looks like it's running at like. <laughs> 15 F FPS, the, the graphics aren't defined yet, but it's literally, this is r really rough footage. This right here, because I know when it comes to Pokemon, fans can be kind of kind of a little finicky with it, but the whole ideology of what they're doing right here, I don't know if I can say it's safe to say that everybody imagined this as a kid playing something like this. But this right here, for me, as a kid, an open world Pokemon game, like like a truly open world Pokemon game where you're like literally in the wild, you see the Pokemon, there's no battle phases, it doesn't transition, you just go straight into the battle like it, like as if like the legitimate show. I've always wanted something like this. And of course it's going to be rough right now because it's in its first stages, but Final product, I'm pretty sure it'll be a, a lot less rough looking and more smooth, etc. Stuff like that. I ain't even looking at that right now. Because this is literally, they're, they're just getting the game assembled together and getting the whole thing together. They're still working on it. It's in development. I understand that and can comprehend that. So, without saying, this is the one I'm most hyped to see. I want this. I will be taking pre-orders for this as soon as it comes out. I don't care. I'm sorry if there are people that are angry in the comments. Because I know we don't really approve of pre-orders that much anymore. But I will pre-order this. I want it. This is something I've always wanted since I was a kid. I mean, that's pretty much all i got to say about that. that. That's what I'm most hyped about. I'm definitely going to be getting Pearl. And I don't know if I'm getting Diamond or Pearl I'm, or both. I think the one, the one that I had when I was younger was Diamond. So, so I, I really miss with Dialga. 
but platinum was the big one for me. I hope I hope later on they come out with platinum at some point. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Can't can't cross my other finger. Fingers crossed. <laughs> but that's pretty much my impressions of that. I love that. I can see why it's number one on trending right now. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, y'all can set y'all feelings in the comments. So that's pretty much it. So um, like subscribe. I'm out, guys. Peace.